Hello everyone, this is Kim with Kim Halls again. Sorry I haven't really been hauling lately. I am currently on vacation, I guess you'd call it, with my mother-in-law. She has some training to do in Kentucky at the military post here, Fort Campbell. And I came with her. And funny story, I'm getting ready. I'm not going to be home until after Thanksgiving. And then about a week later, I leave to go on my cruise with my husband. So, it's going from like wood vacation to another I guess it's sorry if I sound kind of stuffy I'm sick and that's kind of why I'm in my PJs I guess you'd say at 1 30 in the afternoon I have been sick but I wanted to do a collective haul for you guys of Walmart Target Dollar Tree Dollar General Family Dollar and also Michael's and I got a couple things from Vera Bradley I, I'm sure majority of you have heard of it they had a really good sale going on recently, and I got a couple things from there. And then I just have a random ornament that I got that I'll show really quick while we were at the mall there for the Vera Bradley sale. As you guys have heard me say before, I love owls. They're my favorite thing to collect, honestly. And me and my husband, when we got married two years ago, we never really got an ornament or anything that year. So we were there, and I found this. The It was just the owls. And the lady... Uh, did the monogramming for, for for us. So I just put our names, you know, and then our last name when we got married. But I think it's really cute. And I think I want to pay, I think we paid 15 bucks for this. But I love it. I know some people like be a little much, but I absolutely love it. Okay. So at Walmart, they had their fall stuff on sale. And like I said, you know, I love house. I found this and I paid like a dollar for it. And it was originally two for twenty four. So I got that. So I like I said stuffy. And then I went to go visit my childhood best friend that I haven't seen in nineteen years in southern Tennessee, which is about two hours from where I am right now. And we went to the Walmart there and I found this owl puzzle. In the process of putting it together Something to do while she's at work. So, I absolutely love this. And then, here, we went to Walmart and I got this. Which is just a U.S. puzzle of different things. Like, it has Hollywood, South Beach, Las Vegas, D.C., New York, Beverly Hills, Broadway, New Orleans thing, Miami Beach. It's pretty cool. It's a 300-piece puzzle. And this one was 550 550 piece puzzle. And this one was $8.97. No, I won't say this one was the same price. Sorry, this one. Can't be 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure that one was also the same price. And when I was packing to go here, I went and I usually use Caress's body wash, body soap, whatever you want to call it. And I was like, well, I'm going to try something new. Should never have done that. So I got this soft soap body scrub blackberry sugar well honestly i shouldn't have done it because i don't know if you can see i have little dots all over me now i had an allergic reaction to the soap so it smells good and if you've used soft soap before and it doesn't bug you i would try it but for like i said me i'm allergic to apparently something in here which sucks especially when you're on vacation then I wanted some bubble bath stuff here to try to help with the allergic reaction. So I got this Dr. Teal's Pure Epsom Salt Foaming Bath Relax and Relief with the Eucalyptus and Spearmint. And this was like seven bucks. I want to say don't quote me on that. I'm not percent it's I've been here for two weeks and I try to forget stuff. Uh but it works really good. I love the way it foams, it smells good, it feels good on your body. And honestly, it's been helping me feel a little better. And this is almost gone, but I've been taking this because I'm getting sick. And it works awesome. I would recommend it to anyone who gets sick. I, oh, wait. And then, just a random buy, we decided to get some permanent markers. I can't be sorry, guys. That'd be the thing. I'm tired. And this was like six bucks, I think. So, I believe that's all for Walmart. I got a few things at Dollar General that I want to show you. 
Sorry, I put all the washi tape that I've gotten recently in my storage area and a uh, storage bags, I should say. And I got some washi at Dollar General and I want to be able to show you guys because I think they are very awesome. So I wanted to get them out. Sorry about that. Firstly, I got this very cute, I'll try to scoop back to see if it's Happy Holidays. It has these really cute little, oops, sorry little owls and if you notice on this side they are glittery on like the hat up here and then his stomach and his hat on the other side they're just plain so same thing with just plain no glitter and I know you guys like to see metals so this is what the middle looks like nothing special just the light green with the dark green dots and then before I had left this I got why I've been here before I left, I got, um, sorry, <laughs> these charcoal and black sugar, this is a face scrub, face mask, sorry. So I got this one, and then, I'm sorry guys, I'm not trying to yawn for you guys, I'm just trying to get this all done, I just keep yawning. This Dead Sea Minerals Anti-Stress Clay Face Mask. So I got that also. From Dollar General, and these were a dollar, and this bag was two fifty. Sorry, this bag right here was two fifty. Sorry guys, I know I'm not in the loop lately with the prices like usual. And then when I went to, I've been looking at my local Dollar Generals to see if they had the Christmas washing, and I've had no luck at all. It rarely was getting annoying. Well, on the way down to go see my best childhood best friend. Or well, actually, sorry, it was on the way back. We decided to stop in a little town there in Tennessee. And they had a dollar journal. I was like, hey, let's go. Let's see if they had the washi. And that's also where I found that bag. And they had this Christmas washi. I was so excited. I got one of each. There were six. If there's any more, please let me know in the comments. I haven't seen any more than any of them, the ones I've been to. But we'll see. I got, which I think is very beautiful, this Christmas tree. It's red and it just goes... All the way around like that. This white one with holly on it. It says Holly Jolly Christmas. And then there is this. It's like snowflake one. And if you hear vacuuming, sorry, the maids are in the hallway. Housekeeping maids. I don't know what you want to call them. Because, like I said, I am in a hotel room while on vacation. Then this one's also snowflakes with, like, ornaments, I guess you would say. And these are all a dollar. And then this one I thought was very cute. It's got snowmen there. Four snowmen, like a family, basically, I would say, almost. A snowman there. Some dots. I don't know what you would want to call that. And then the Christmas tree. And then Santa's part of Santa's head. And then this just, I guess you call this holly or, I don't know for sure what you call it. But it's just those all the way around. And I want to say that was it for Dollar General. And then we'll do Target really fast. And then we'll do Michael's and lastly we will do Dollar Tree. I went to Target, there's a small Target here, well not exactly here, here, but in Clarksville, Tennessee, which is like 15 minutes from where I'm at right now, and they have their Halloween on clearance for 90%, so anything that was a dollar is now 10 cents. So I got these really cool looking marble tags, and I think you could use these for more than just Halloween, honestly. So I got these for 10 cents, there's eight here. And it comes with the string and it says just says marble tags and like I said they were 90% off so I got them for a dollar or 10 cents not a dollar and then I'm sorry I can't find the one to fill up more. it is somewhere around here there was oh that's not it sorry here it is the marble uh washi that was for Halloween that was also 10 cents this Chalkboard labels, adhesive, two sheets, 12 count per sheet. So you get 24. And it's cats, headstones, and pumpkins. And these were also 10 cents. 
Now, I was looking for Christmas washi. I didn't find a whole bunch. I found some. And this one has come unraveled. I'm trying to fix it real quick before I show it. Sorry, guys. I really apologize. Okay, so I found this. See, it was unraveled. I found this Christmas washi. And then, oh, I also, before I forget, found the pumpkin and the bat washi. And I sent the pumpkins off in a friend wheel. And the bats are around here somewhere that are like that. I found this glitter tape basically green for Christmas. I found this white one. And those, these are all a dollar also. It kind of just looks like white with gold dots to me. And then this plaid one. For... Uh, oh, sorry, I can't remember. Oh, this plaid Christmas one. And then, like I said, you know me and I love my owls. I sold this and I just was like, oh my god, I have to have it. It's three dollars, even though I rather spend a dollar on stuff like this. But the owls, they just spoke to me. There's 16 cards and envelopes, and these are the patterns the reindeer, and the reindeer scarf has foil on it, and the rest of them have some glitter. The owls, then there's a s'more right here. It's a bear, a fox, and an owl up there. And then Christmas trees. And these three have glitter. This owl one says on the inside, Happy holidays to you and those you hold dear, or then those dear to you. The one with the bear, the owl, and the fox says on the inside, May you hold the magic of the season close to your heart. This little deer right there says wishing you happiness during the holiday season and throughout the, the coming year and the christmas tree on the outside it says joy Oops, sorry see down there and on the inside it says warm wishes for a wonderful holiday season and i want to say this was all that i got at target yes and i just dropped some home for i'm so sorry okay and we will do like i said michael's next I'm just dropping stuff all over the floor. And my kid is falling. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, so there's Michael's right in town. I have fallen in love with it. Somewhat. Uh, they've had grab bags. I've gotten a few things. I'm not really going to grab everything out that was in the grab bags. There were some of those Mylar balloons I've gotten. Um, there was... A little cat. Stuff like that. Sorry, I'm trying to grab all the stuff that I got out. Because I've been using a lot of this for my, uh... Bucket letters. Okay. So, first of all, this was actually in... I want to say Nashville? Yeah, I found these in Nashville. And they are at one of their mall Michaels. It says reflections, embellishments, and these are flowers. These are originally $4.99, and I only paid 99 cents for them. And I absolutely think they're beautiful. This one as well was $4.99. And this is 12 pieces, sorry. And then this one was 72 pieces. And it's also reflections, embellishments. And these are just like little flowers with uh, jewels in the middle. And they're really beautiful, I think. And there's 72 in that one. This is leaves, or they say this is flowers, but they're leaves to me. Kind of cracks me up. And these were also $4.99 originally, and I got them for $0.99 because they were in the fall clearance, I guess you'd call it. And then this had so many. Oops, sorry. I'm off the top. I've used some of these in pocket letters already, and these had 72 pieces as well. They were $4.99, $4.99. And I sandwiched different colors, flowers. And then this one as well. To me, this is more fall. This one and the last one are more fall colors than the first one. And like I said, this one was $4.99 as well. It had 72 pieces. And I got for 99 cents. I got... Let's see if I can shake these up a little bit. They don't want to come apart. They're just different. I don't know if you can somewhat see. They're like... They still say flowers, they're in the thing, but they are leaves. And then I also, and those were $4.99 I got for $0.99. Cents. And then these also, leaves. 
four nine nine worth of money, nine nine cents. And then I got the leaves. They were also nine nine cents, and I can't remember how much they were. Honestly, I'm so sorry. Oh, sorry, they were a dollar ninety nine, and that's twenty of them. I used them. And then just some more colors. And then these, I want to say, were like ten cents, maybe a little bit more. They were only dollar fifty, and they're pumpkins and like pilgrim hats is what I would call them. I right, have my notes and stuff in the way it means. Sorry, but guys. Okay. And then, oh, I almost forgot about these. Thinking about them. See, mine's don't always work right. I got this owl bracelet. I just collect them because of the owls. It's orange. And I don't know if you can make out the owl. And I go for a dollar. I got this before I found the other washi tapes I found. And I absolutely love it. It was originally $4.99. I got for $1.99. The green glitter. And it is, sorry. The sticker's over the thing. I'm trying to hurry up and get it for you guys. I'm so sorry. Like I said, I've been sick, so usually I'm together with these hauls. Not with being sick, I'm not sorry. It is 8. 0.875 inches by 10 feet. So you get 10 feet on this. And it's from Hello or I think it's Head Swap, Heat Swap. Heidi Swap, sorry. This is from Heidi Swap. Like I said, it was $4.99 originally and I got it for $1.99. And then this is also from Heidi Swap. And I think it's the same amount. I'm pretty sure it's the same amount. Sorry, this is by 12 feet. 8.875 by 4 feet, or 10, 12 feet. And this was originally $4.99, and I got it for $1.49, and it's just like candy cane, is that what I'd call it. And then, they had a sale earlier this week. They had this for $5.99, I think it said it was originally $19.99. And it's just paper stock in different colors. Sorry, let's look at the heck. And I've been using these for my fall pocket letters. And those are basically all the colors you get right there. And like I said, it was on sale for $5.99. I want to say, like I said, it was originally $19.99. And it says Neutrals Craftsmith Paper Pack. So I got that. And then I got this. I had a 40% off sticker, or 40% off thing. So I got this. Project Becky Higgins Project Life 130 pieces Christmas wishes things for my pocket letters. That's what I use this for actually. And it's just got different cards, embellishments, or clipboard embellishments as they call them. Small cards, big cards. And it says 34 by 6 specialty cards, 33 by 4 specialty cards, and 70 clipboard embellishments. And this basically just shows you what they have and if I start going a little quick I'm sorry I just want to get through this before the time cuts off I only have a few more stores I got these with also with my 50% off and at another time and they were originally $7.99 so I guess you would go four bucks I paid for them and they are color you color the trees in and I figured I would just, they're called the Color Stream. And I figured I'd just send them off like this. And let the people decide how they want to do it. And there are 12 cards and 12 envelopes. And it says, hoping this year brings you gifts of joy and love. So there's that one. And then, of course, the yells. And it's also the same thing. I also got it 50% off by Color Stream. Their 2016 collection. And on the inside it says, have a Merry Christmas. And there's also 12 cards in here. And 12 envelopes. Let's put this over here, sorry. And then I guess we will move on to Dollar Tree. That is our last. Or well, before the Dollar Tree, actually, I'll show you the few things I got from Veer Bradley. They have right now in some of their stores, there's an outlet store in Nashville if you're near Nashville. And it has a, a two spots right next to each other that are 70% off. And when we went last week and they had a sale that was 20% extra, 20% off, 50% off the store. And I don't know if that's still going on. And they weren't supposed to do it on clearance, but they did. So, 
This I know was originally $98 and I got it for 20 something. And it's a weekender bag and it's pretty big on the inside. And I know it's an old pattern, but I still love it. I think it's beautiful. I know some people want the newest patterns that are in. I don't really care. I just love these bags. I have a couple of the Vera Bradley purses and I love them. And I mean love, love them. And then this is also the backpack. Because I was looking for a backpack for my, to take with my carry on for my cruise. So I found this and I was like, oh my god, I found a regular bag. And then I was like, oh my god, this works too. It's a backpack. And it's a backpack backpack, but I figured I could use it for whatever. And I've already started using it as you can tell. And it's got the front. And then the inside there. And then that's where your laptop would go. And then I don't know where it went. I just saw it a little bit ago. My wallet's around here somewhere. It's just a little trash. Oh, here it is. Sorry. And I'm using it currently. So I'm going to blur out or put my hand over my license. This is the inside of the wallet. Sorry, like I said, I'm trying to cover up my license. And then... You know, it's got the license slot and then one slot above it, then the money slot right here. And then there's three slots over here that has the pocket and the pockets. And then the zipper part right here. And I need to hurry up with this haul. Sorry, guys. I'm starting to run a little low. Sorry, at 21 minutes. I'm so sorry. Okay. Now, a Dollar Tree here. I've been seeing people haul these. It is the Rudolph collection. Here is Bumble. I'm so sorry, guys. Clarice. Or however you say your name. I was saying it wrong. Santa and Rudolph. So I got those four. And then... Sorry, I'm trying to hurry. I got these. Because of the owl at Dollar Tree. And I almost forgot there's a couple of family dollar things that I will throw in right at the end. I'm trying to work. I got this little bag here. And it just says canvas tote. It's a gift from my mom. I got these two puzzles. Don't really like them. I'm giving them to a friend. I don't like how they're not separated. It's all jumbled together. So. Yes. And it was like a castle. Fairy tale fish and to me that looks like a fairy so i'm giving those to a friend um of course more owls and it's 3d so i found that um i found a bunch of washi i'm just going to show the inside of it to you guys all these washi i don't know if you can see i found every single one at dollar tree recently and then these, I'm surprised. I have not seen anybody else haul these. And I found them in Pulaski, Tennessee, where my childhood best friend lives. So, I think that's really cool. And then, sorry to show you guys these other ones out of this one. I'm trying to hurry. I'm so sorry. I got all of these. Hopefully you can see them. And the only one that I've ever had before was this one. And like this is one of the ones I found in Pulaski. It's those like shiny and it's a deco tape too. But I found all of those. Sorry, I'm trying to do the best way to hurry it. Because of how, where the time is. I found, I've heard some people talking about this book. It's called, sorry. I'm so sorry, this is a bad video. It's The Queen's Lover. And it says, Paris, 1744. Count Axel von Fersen is at a masquerade ball when he meets the young and mesmerizingly beautiful Marie Antoinette. Their electric encounter launches in a love affair that will span across, span the course of the French Revolution. At first sight, Fersen becomes a devoted companion to the entire royal family. He learns the deepest secrets of the court until he tears himself away from his beloved to join the fight for America. American independence. When he returns to France, he is on the brink of dis discrimination. I can't say that word right. I'm so sorry. After a failed attempt to free the royal family before they face the guillotine, he goes home to Sweden where he soon meets his own tragic end. And I think it sounds very good. 
and it's originally $16, and I got it for Dead Dollar Tree for a dollar, of course. Finally found one of these clipboards that are, like, decorative. I love it. Um, sorry guys. I have been putting it off and putting them off and putting them off buying these. I finally decided to get some of the stackable organizer drawers. I got four. They are all in this bag. So I got four of these. Sorry, like I said, guys, I'm trying to hurry to get this done. I got some of these clips, decorative clips, I think is what they're called, paper clips. Two of them have been used. I don't know where the other one is of this. And I don't know if any of you guys have been noticing lately that a lot of like Walmart and Dollar Tree bags are like really bad or worse than they used to be. But anyways, I got this one and I got this, which is the notebook colorable notebook cover. And you could probably remove it and use it again. I got the little one, but like I said, I cannot find it right now for some reason. I found this paper taper paper tape stickers basically washi on a thing I've gotten some Christmas books I am so sorry nothing wants to work for me today I'm making sure there's no okay I got these two Mickey ones and they're Christmas in activity I'll just like quickly show you a few things so there's one Here's another. That one was just Mickey. This one is Minnie and Mickey on the cover. I think it's almost basically the same thing, but I have some video I might give these to. Frosty. And there's a couple different Frosty ones, I think. And like I said, it's got Frosty and some of the animals. I got two Rudolphs. I can't remember the guy's name, but one was with Rudolph and Clarice. And one's Rudolph with the uh, I don't know who that guy is. I haven't seen a reference long for honestly. It's got different things. The other one. Sorry, like I said, I'm trying to hurry before I run out of time. And this is just the Christmas jumbo activities. Book and coloring. Just different pages. And then the silent night. Holiday Adult Coloring Book by Kappa, originally $3.95. Different picture, oh, that's thing, like different pictures. They're very beautiful. And it says if you enjoy this, look for Merry and Bright. Which, look what I found, Merry and Bright. And I'm hurrying guys, I'm already at 28 minutes, I'm so sorry. I finally found some of these Kylie nail colors. I found this one, which is Magic Touch. Sorry, I'm hurrying. This one is Cashmere. I'm coming again, so sorry. This one is Karma. This one is Sinful. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Crushed Velvet. I think they're beautiful. Finally, I'm just going to put all these together. These are the gel, like gel, I like colors. Sorry, they're not wanting to stay in my hand. This is the reflective and sleek. And then the clear coat. I finally found these. I haven't seen these at my local ones. And then I might not be able to get the family dollar in here. Or stuff in here, sorry. I got this box. And the really annoying thing about this box is. Sorry, I have stuff in here. Oh, I found the other owl sticker. I forgot to put it in here. This is the other owl colorable one. Uh, here's the front. Here's the inside. Now, if you put it the right way, here's the inside. Didn't realize that till I got it. Here's the back. So if you do that, that's upside down. Okay. Then I got these stickers. People have been telling me Santa looks really weird. I finally found some lip smackers. I got three for now. I've only found the lip chapstick, whatever you want to call them. This one is Cherry Cobbler, Coconut Cake, and Stellar Strawberry. I found the LA Matte, or LA Colors Pout Lip Gloss, Super Shine. This one is Smooch. 
I found a couple diamond things. I think I'm about to run out of time. The eyeliners. And I actually really like these. I think I swatched them on my hand earlier. They're really good. So it comes in a two pack. So I got both of them. And then they're supposed to be an eyeliner. I would probably use it more as an eyeshadow. And I guess since I actually have time, it shows. I will show you the couple out things I got from Family Dollar. Yes, I know. Ow. These were buy one, get one half off. He's a little cute out. He says, greetings. And like I said, he was $2. So I got this little guy for a dollar. These are kind of like the ones they have at Dollar Tree, but they don't have sayings on them. This one says, welcome. And then I got these little salt and pepper shakers. And unlike the ones from, oh, I can't think of where I got them. Well, I have ones at home that are different than these, but I figured these I could keep out all year round because they're not really completely fall to me. So, I will try to, let me see if I can do a better job so that you guys can see. I don't I think I'm going to be able to. Well, anyways, that is my haul. My hotel bed is now a mess. I am super sorry that it was all messed up. Please forgive me. Like I said before, I'm very new to this. I will try my best next time to do better. Have a great time. Happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Because I probably will not be back on here till after Thanksgiving. Hope everyone has a great Thanksgiving. And thank you for watching. Bye.